Um, I'm from Wausau originally, and I've been here um, pretty much my whole life. I moved to Superior for a couple years, but I moved back. So I really enjoy the Wausau area. I'm married. I have a uh, daughter. She's seven months old. Her name's Avery. Um, I enjoy cooking, spending time outside, reading, just having fun in the kitchen. I've always liked to cook. When I was little, I remember watching infomercials and always enjoying the knife ones and seeing them chop and that. So a lot of people in my family cook too, my parents, my grandparents and things like that. So I've always been inspired to cook and I actually made a career change when I was in my mid-20s to become a chef full-time. Before that, I worked um, as an insurance rep. So it was quite a different change from the office to the kitchen. I started working at Downtown Grocery and then I actually went to culinary school at Nicolet and Ryan Lander. Um, I graduated from there about five years ago. Um, continued to work at Downtown Grocery, and then I came to Red Eye, um, and I've been at Red Eye since um, the beginning of the restaurant, before it even opened. It's the most fun I've ever had in my life. Um, to me, it's not a job, it's just a passion, and every day is a new adventure in the kitchen. Um, I know it's going to be a challenge, I know it'll be um, interesting, nerve-wracking, but above all, just to have fun and to support a good cause. I'm looking to make this uh, the second year in a row for a female chef to win, so watch out, Chef Dan. I uh, came from this area, grew up, and um, just been living here all my life. Uh, happily married to a beautiful woman and um, just enjoying life. I started in the restaurant industry 38 years ago and uh, worked my way up through the ranks, worked at different places and had the opportunity to work with other qualified chefs that, that I learned from. and. Uh, have, have just been fortunate in, in my career. I've always had the instinct for it and it's always just been something that has come natural for me. So I think there was other powers that, higher power that uh, made that decision for me. And I'm the president of the Chef Association at this time and I was uh, Chef of the Year in 2010 and runner-up for that position the year before that. I expect to have a good time with it. Uh, I, I expect to be as good as my competition and uh, hopefully the judges think that I'm a little better. So. Chef Elizabeth, be ready because I will be ready and you can bring it on.